Everyone we help on George the Rescue is deserving, but we've never had anyone like the man we're going to surprise today. Corporal Sherman Watson is a Marine who served three tours in Iraq. He's been shot twice, blown up once, and awarded three Purple Hearts. Now he's back home, living in Compton, California with his wife and two daughters, and like all of us, could use a hand around the house. I am honored to give him the help he needs. My name is Sherman Watson. I'm Kyra Watson, and welcome to our home in Compton, California. You know, you, you hear a lot of people say the Marines made a man out of me. Well, my mom made a man out of me. The Marine Corps, they just molded that. You can become something even greater than yourself by helping others. Uh, and me helping my country, that's, th that was an, an awesome feeling. I love my country and I would do anything for my country. After um, school and infantry, I was um, attached with 3rd Battalion, 5th Marines. Weapons Company. Um, I was um, in the CAT platoon, combined anti-armor team. I served with them from 2002 to 2007, I believe, um, to three combat tours all to Iraq, um, 2003, 2004, and 2006. I was injured a total of three times, three separate deployments, and three Purple Hearts. But I would say the, the one injury that really, you know, put me down, that I couldn't come back from was the, the IED. <clears throat> it was, um, uh, uh, excuse, me. excuse me. I believe it was a remote detonated. Um, it could have been pressure, pressure detonated, I'm not sure, because I, I did see some shining, that's all I remember. And I was out for nine and a half hours, and I was unconscious for nine and a half hours, so had memory problems. I, I do not remember nothing from the event. I still have memory problems from what I've done in the Marine Corps up to that point, and, and even some memory problems from my childhood. I, I can't remember a lot of stuff. I haven't talked about that in a long time. <laughs> I would say the, the overall lesson that I learned as a Marine was life is short. It is, it's hella short. And if you find someone, you need to really spend your time with them because it can be taken away so fast. And I'm, I'm really enjoying life right now. And, I, and I, I, I strive to complete everything that I want to do in life because I truly understand now. This is our first home we purchased in 2010, mm -hmm. spring 2010. We absolutely love it, but there's some, some things that need to be touched up a little bit here and there. And you don't like the color of the house? Mm, paint job, yeah. Can definitely <laughs> use a paint job. We can definitely use a new fence. Grass. Yeah. Uh, I mean, I, I, I can up, if we can get the grass to grow again, I will fight the gophers. I would not lose this time, I promise. I will stand my frontal attack and I will win because I had grass before and I loved it. It smelled great. Doesn't smell like dirt and then dirt flying everywhere. When the wind blows, I just, Love grass. We just have some grass. I'm sorry, did I say grass? <laughs> I, I just miss how grass looks in the backyard. <laughs> I miss it. Hello, oh, Sherman? Hello. Yes, How's it going, sir. my friend? How you doing? I'm George Oliphant. Oh, yeah. Nice to meet you. It's nice to meet I you, sir. I've heard about you. Well, I've heard a lot about you, and I am here to help you out and rescue your home. This is it? This is it. Oh. <laughs> Kyra, how are you? I'm great. George Oliphant, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. So, uh, yeah, we're here. We're here to rescue this home of yours. I understand you guys have uh, just a few little issues you want to deal with, and uh, <laughs> hey, that's my specialty. You, for everything you have done for America, for our country, it's the least I can do. So I'm bringing in my team, and we're here to help you out. Wow. 
Wow. What do you say? I can't believe it. Huh? <laughs> so you did not. Is that gonna be all right with you? Yeah, it's all right. That's all right in my book. Thank you so much. Your house Thank you. Helping us out with Corporal Sherman Watson's house, we are general contractor Jim Collins and our designer Christopher Grubb. Guys, thanks for being here with me. You're Glad welcome. to be here, man. Glad so, be here. as you can see, this is this is this is Corporal Watson's house, and uh, it definitely needs our help. I mean, there's there's cracking in the foundation. The the exterior is a mess. I don't even really know where to start, so that's why I brought both you guys. Well, in. you know, the house has some good bones. So it's got a good structure, but it, man, it just needs a facelift. I'm picturing this whole Americana theme going on with this, you know. That'd be really nice. served our country, and it would be really great, starting with the picket fence coming in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Work out a porch here for the family. Maybe some shutters or something on some the window just to face them great. up a little and bit. Just pragmatic stuff, something that's really, really beautiful. Let's get to work. Let's All right, go. let's do it. Guys, we have a big job ahead of us. Gonna take a lot of manpower. Christopher, Jim, yeah. this is what I'm talking about. Yeah! All right! All right. All right. All right. All right. For color, inspiration, and so much more, visit a Benjamin Moore store. To locate a Benjamin Moore store near you, log on to BenjaminMoore.com. You guys ready to rescue? Yeah! All right, let's do it! On demo day or any time with construction, there's so much that can go wrong, so you always got to make sure safety first. Protect your eyes, your ears, and your lungs. You do that, everything should turn out okay. Jim, it's amazing the difference that it makes just ripping off that rickety, dark awning that we took down. And it was a good thing we took it off because it looked like it was ready to come down any minute anyway. But So what are we going to put in its place? Well, it's going to be great. Now that we got, the, we got a new ledger board up there, right? Got the Echo Red, and then we're pulling out here to make a really nice structure. It's going to look beautiful from the street, be nice and safe. And then we'll put a railing all around the front here. It's good for all the kids. The, exactly. So they can sit up on the porch, watch the kids play in the brand new yard, which we're putting together for them, and really feel comfortable and relaxed. That's why I got the hard hat on. Some of this lumber comes swinging. You don't see it. One more in the middle. Boom. We're all set. You want to install the casing? Let's do this. Master craftswoman right here. And I still got all my nails. All right, so Sean, this is uh, the foundation for our deck right now. Yes, sir. What, uh, why, the, why the red wood? What color is fire? Uh, hot red, I guess. Red, exactly. So what, this is all fire retardant? Fire retardant, mold, fungus, and termite. Oh, wow, so uh, Sherman's never gonna have to worry about any of that stuff. Mold, mildew. Nothing eating it, corroding it. fires, we're good to go. No burning either, sir. Does that mean you can barbecue right on top of this? Yeah. Awesome. I mean, could I have just popped out the hinges? Yes, but is that any fun? No. George the Rescue is sponsored in part by 3M. For more information on 3M products or to find a retailer near you, go to 3M.com. Now that we got the garage cleaned out and prepped, it's time to make it organized. And that's where our friends from Taylor Living featuring Premier Garage come in. The best in the business. Let's get the truck unloaded and make that place perfect for Sherman and his family. Come on here, I got Yep, No problem, no problem. How you doing? I'm How you doing, doing, doing great. I'm doing great. No, I got the cabinet. All right. 
Is this on the uh, outtake reel? Hey, you know, they do call me George Rescue. You guys want me to put the screw in? I can probably handle it. We're covering up the tile with wood, but on the actual fireplace, we're putting tile. This is actually marble, and it's on webbing. It webs and links together. It's really easy to install. And I love because it's natural, the variations in the material. It's going to look so great with the wood floor. And it's exciting. When you walk in, it's visually really, really interesting. It's way better than the stucco. There is no reason for an act as simple as removing a nail from a wall to take all weekend long. Basically, it should take half a day. With 3M Patch Plus Primer Lightweight Spackling, you get to skip a step. You don't have to prime it. It'll be dry in 30 minutes rather than two hours. Well, it's been, I should say, a amazing ride. I mean, here staying at this wonderful hotel, the Lux, here in downtown Los Angeles, right across the street from Staples Center. It's a wonderful feeling that uh, we, we're treated like, you know, for at least two weeks, kings and queens. <laughs> While the house is being renovated, I, I love every moment of it. It says a lot that, you know, people that don't know you, but they served in the military, and they still have your back, even back here and they come and still give a, you know, a, a lending hand. It's an experience that words can't can explain. George the Rescue is brought to you in part by the Lux City Center Hotel, an urban oasis in the heart of Los Angeles. You know, Dandy, that was my job for every summer when I was in high school. I was a masker. I like to say I was a painter, but I didn't really ever get a paint. I just masked. <laughs> the inside of the garage, we're gonna use Benjamin Moore Aura. We're using the color Swiss Coffee. It gives great coverage. It's uh, always gonna be the color you ask for if you get Benjamin Moore paints because of the proprietary color lock technology. They do all the research, they know the ingredients, they know the pigments to use. So if you try to match it somewhere else, you're gonna be disappointed. So Clayton, instead of putting up a pergola or putting up any sort of permanent covering, we are putting up shade sails. Exactly. Uh, the shade sail is great because it's not permanent. Uh, they can literally put them up once the brackets go in and every couple of years, you know, depending on what type they buy and what uh, durability, you know, they can just switch them up. This is good. So there's, yeah. Nice. Look what I'm doing. Do that and look at it. I'll, I'll just come behind you and put a little tip on them all. Love it. Boom. It's teamwork. This is teamwork on George the Rescue. Last but certainly not least, Glamo. Done High and five. done. Done. Thank you. Thanks. I'm just going to finish these over here. Oh, shoot. Yeah. <laughs> Ready? Mm -hmm. Done. Except for that one. Oh, man! I was already <laughs> for the high five and everything. <laughs> Okay, now this one's gonna be really good. That, that was sucked. A terrible high five. <laughs> nice. Now that all the construction's done, it's time to start decorating the living room. We got our furniture here from Michaels. Let's get the truck unloaded. Start setting things up. I think we know what branch of the military Sherman was a part of. Now all we gotta do is bring him back home. done an awful lot of home improvement projects, but I've never seen so much love. So many different people, different organizations just putting in their sweat and blood for Sherman uh, for a really, really good cause. And I think when he comes back tonight, 
I think his heart is going to sing. This is a whole, this is a whole new, a whole new house for him and his family. And when he sees the amount of effort and work that's been put into it by so many different people, I think he'll really, really understand how much we do appreciate what he did and what he did for his country, what he did for his family, what he did for me personally. When I first heard Sherman's story, I thought, this is something that I want to be involved with. I mean, he's such a great guy. What he's been through is beyond anything I could ever even imagine. And I want to do anything I can to help out. The, the work ethic of people, the hours they've stayed here, they're here early, they're here late, the sun's going down, they're still here asking, what can I do? You know, what can I participate in? It's just been, it's a great, great opportunity. And the thrill of seeing everybody helping out with it. It's amazing. Uh, I tell you what, any of these guys right here would do anything for him, and most of us have never met him, but we just know his story, we know who he is and what he's done, and we will be there 100% uh, for him anytime that he needs us. So that's just another thing that's great that you're not gonna find really anywhere else, you know, than uh, the armed service. To be a part of something like this makes you feel good inside, that life's just not about yourself, what I have, I need to share with others. So to be a part of this, to help this family, this hero returning from war, makes me feel good inside that I've done at least something to help the cause. It feels good for us to have done this for you, Sherman. And uh, all I can say, brother, is um, you earned it, man. And it's, it's our honor to do this for you. And uh, can't wait to meet you. And uh, I don't even know you, but you're already family. You're already family. <laughs> Look at all these. Y'all are crazy. What are y'all doing? <laughs> it's like a little army. Keep looking over here. Okay, I'm Don't look at the house. Okay. All these people came together to make your house absolutely perfect. After everything that you did for our country and for all of us, it's the least that we could do for you. Are you ready? Yes. Are you ready yes. to come home? Yes. All right. Three, two, one. Turn around and take it all in. Oh my. Want to go inside? Yes, yes, we want to go inside. All right. Okay, honey, watch your step. Follow me. Ah, oh, wow. Oh, my goodness, look at the fireplace. God. Oh, my God. Ah. <laughs> oh, my God. That Shut up. is. What? Gorgeous. What is that? That's what you call a bag deck. What? <laughs> it's, it's a little oasis. Oh, oh no gophers. God. No gophers. What? This is so amazing. Uh oh, slow down. Oh. Slow down. Oh. <laughs> Something caught her eyes. <laughs>
you guys, thank you so much. This is amazing. Volunteers, friends and family, thank you all for coming. I mean, this house is, is, is breathtaking. We bought it three years ago, and I never would imagine it would look anything this remarkable. Thank you so much. I mean, it's just walking through the house, it just seems so new, different, you know, something out of a out of a book, contemporary living or something. <laughs> Thank you so much. And um and I, I just wish some of my brothers were here today to see this. And um I just I just really miss them as well. And please keep them in our heart in in your hearts too. And uh Thank you so much. This is this is amazing. <laughs> know someone in need of a rescue? Send us an email at george at nbc.com. <laughs>